Hey guys, King Casey here. Welcome to a brand new Fortnite video for you guys. I know it has been a while since I have recorded one of these. But yeah, we are going to be doing a Fortnite video and this is a victory this is a match where we actually get a win on film without going into replay mode, which I think is really, really cool. So yeah, I'm playing with Michael with this one. You might be able to hear him in the background. I actually didn't know that it recorded part of the chat, so uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So now let's just get on with the, the yeah, gameplay. We're going to be doing the same thing as 50v50 Mayhem. And we are actually going oh, to be uh, talking over the, the replay. And here I didn't actually know what this puzzle piece was. Because <laughs> Michael told me you might be able to hear him. And he said it's a ch challenge. So yeah, I picked that up. And yeah. So then we continued on our way. This wasn't really a high kill game. Thinking back, we only got four kills in total as a whole squad. And you'll see where I get my kill. Michael gets carried through this whole thing. And I think it's overall a pretty good game. Yeah, but it was nice to get a dub for a change. And, uh, yeah, okay. So pretty much me and Michael were doing this challenge. Like, okay, so we're going to land at Greasy Grove. We're going to dress up as the oh, yeah. burger skin and the, the grill sergeant and we're gonna land there and see if we can get a dub and we did yeah, but yeah overall let's get to summarizing this thing so I am looking around for any more loot that we could have used since as you can see wow I do not have that good loot because I only have a green AR and a white tack and uh, even though those weapons, well, the 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 um common tech isn't that good. The green AR is decent, but yeah, overall I could be going for a lot be better load out here. Okay. Anyways, moving on. So pretty much, uh, yeah. This is me and Michael just messing around. I'm ordering. I think I said a dur burger, dur fries, a dur sandwich. Dur shake and a dur yeah, I, that's probably that? what I can remember. Yeah, we didn't really take this game too seriously. <laughs> so as you can see, Michael is just boogieing to pretend that yeah, he's yeah, cooking yeah. the grill. Yeah. Oh my lord. Yeah, but this uh yeah, then I tell him to hurry up, the storm is coming. Right, and yeah, you you're gonna be able to hear him with all his reactions, so that's why I lowered the sound a bit, so okay. I could talk over all this. Yeah, so then we finally decided to move out, and then we begin okay. to head out toward the Tiki Head, or like, the Dolphin Island. <sighs> I forgot what the island where like the, oh yeah, Easter Island. Yeah, we go up to one of those heads, yeah, like and pretty much we get a rift, and I don't actually get any, any gear. Yeah. I th oh, I think I may get a better tactical, but I think I just rock this low loadout for pretty stop. much like half of the uh, game, and then uh, I'll get some more gear later on, and you'll that's see my final loadout. Like, that's perfect. But yeah, so. Anyway, let's get on with this re with this cinematic replay, whatever you want to call it. As you can see, Michael breaks down the tiki head. I pick up these clingers, and I'm trying to remember where I get a certain weapon. Half, I'll just have to remember where I get it from. But we we start tracking going down. We actually go to the football field first. Because Michael thought he saw some people here, which again, you'll be able to hear. I'm gonna have to tell him that his party actually recorded into the gameplay. So, <laughs> oh yeah. So yeah, this is probably one of the longest games I've had on this series. On this series, 
because even though I've only done five gameplays, I have three more coming to you this week. And if you check on my I discussion, on um, the discussion tab, I actually I posted I what videos I'm planning to uh, to upload. Right. So most of those are going to be scheduled, and then some others might be uploaded. I have no idea what I'm doing right, yet. But yeah, we, I go flying in into the football field, and uh, yeah. Like, what's wrong? There's a a, a, no one here. So yeah, it's been a pretty boring gameplay so far, but don't worry. Things will get more intense as we go okay. along. And there it is, the weapon I was talking about. I obtained a grenade launcher, which only has two rockets right now. Okay, so so I don't use it often. I use it in one skirmish that we get it into, but... I don't use it much, and I just um, want to say, rip drum, drum um, gun. That was my favorite gun in the whole game, not because it could just spray, just because that it had the long, like the the close range of a SMG and the medium range of an assault rifle while still doing decent damage. But yeah, so yeah, so Michael has a rift to go, and we're gonna use that. I'm arc tilted and. Yeah, we knew there were going to be some people here. There's only... We're in top 30 by this point. Which, we're just entering the first circle. Which, I don't know. It's been getting really low. And Fortnite uh, Season 6 is coming. I'm going to re record my reactions to, to the Battle Pass. And I'm going to put that up on the first day Season 6 comes out. It's going to be a good one. I know, I'm just, uh, oh, I better just be quiet at this point. Oh, my lordy lord, whatever. Okay, so, uh, yeah, pretty much one more week left. Huh. Yeah, well, okay, come on, back on track. Yeah, I have a tendency to, um, just go off. This is why I do commentating over all of this and give you guys a gameplay in the background. Yo, I am. Oh yeah, but uh, okay, now we're actually gonna getting into the halfway mark and the more interesting part. Yes, we get into our first skirmish. I don't know why I do live living large, but yeah, I, I don't know why I did that. But I see some people, I throw my clinger, yeah, I missed that badly. I go for a grenade launcher, then I throw my last clingers, and yeah, that does some pretty good damage on them. Michael somehow whips a blue AR out of nowhere, like he's God or something. But yeah, I get pick up the the blue AR. I really want to push, but Michael and the others say to fall back and just keep at a distance, and then we'll get ready to fight. So then I decide to basically stay up there for a bit. I fire some AR shots, I miss all of them since I cannot aim. Yeah, I'm not that good at the game, but I'm decent. I'm better than I was in my first gameplay, that's for sure. But okay, so I, I'm i just gonna go in, I slide down the hill, and then I come down here. Michael's coming with me, and uh, yeah, then we're going on sneaks. Yeah, I broke the tree, which basically gave them their position. I run behind here, and then we get ready for the push. And we begin our ascent upward. And then, yeah, there's a guy right there. <laughs> yeah, Michael gave me some advice to stop. Yeah, they placed a roof above me, so me and Michael fall, fall back onto the stairwell we take cover behind like the like ladder stair things i don't know what what you call them up then me and michael go from the bottom and we do a bit of breaking and entering into the nearest apartment and then me and michael slowly get it up there we're obviously making a lot of noise because of my pickaxe but yeah we and we make our ascent up the apartment, tactical and SMG in hand, and then we get both of our shotguns, and our teammates are at the top, Michael breaks, and we go for it. Our guy, and then they're behind us, Michael gets knocked, but I managed to finish the job, 10 HP, and I heal up Michael. 
I know, that was um, not the most craziest fight. Oh yeah, and he wanted me to save the tactical shotgun for him. I know it wasn't the most biggest fight we... The most biggest fight, but that's probably like the most that I get involved into a battle. Yeah, but that's probably the the fight where I help out the most. And I don't really help much in this gameplay. It's just that I either get knocked right off the bat, or I just really don't get any kills. We only get into one other fight this whole gameplay, so we pretty much were riding the storm. With that, the storm circle begins to move in, so we are just booking it away. I managed to pick up a green tack and a semi-auto, and we just begin to book it away. I'm trying to organize my inventory while I run, since I don't know, I like organizing inventories. And then, us three take this path this way, Michael goes for the gorge below. I'm farming mass just in case if I need to make a stairway to get around a mountain, and I just fall down these, hit a rock. I thought I was going to take fall damage, but I didn't. We just begin to make our ascent up the mountain, and hopefully into the safe circle. Right now, there's only 15 players left. I know that isn't much, but yeah, we didn't really do much, and I get, t I get tickled by the storm here. And I actually am in it for a bit, and then I get out. Michael barely makes it out. And then I... He has a med kit, so I'm going to use my last band-aid. Yeah, we... I didn't really have much health during this. I didn't get any shield. I, I did have shield, though. I really just... Stayed on my health. Okay. So, okay, moving on. So then we begin to make our way into the final storm circle. And then we move into this house here, which really wouldn't have much good loot. And then we open the chest, and I don't take any of it. Our friend takes a slurp. He's at low health, so we let him have it. Michael gets a double barrel. I drop down, and lo and behold, there's another one. Yeah, and Michael is hogging a blue tack and a double barrel. I tell him to give me the blue tack because he can't swap between them. But he says, no, that two seconds might come in handy. Then I say, dude, really? Yes, that isn't going to work out. If that two seconds, someone could just swap to an SMG and shred you. And then Michael finally agrees and okay, and then decide. gives me the blue tack. I give him my green tack because I'm nice. Okay, now we're in top ten. There's it's me, it's us four, a team of three, and I think there was another team of three. I don't actually know what happened to the other team. Yeah, but they pretty much get shredded in this scene here, and they get all killed. Yeah, most of them get knocked out. Oh, no, you actually have we start to look at that over there, since that looks like where they're probably going to be. But yeah, they're having their own little skirmish over there. Sure. We're making our way, and there you go! One guy took out a whole entire squad. Good job, man. But okay. Now we're entering the anti-gravity field. The probably... We need to be stealthy, so I told Michael not to uh, jump. This is in the anti-gravity dome is where the final battle takes place and I think it was a pretty cool way to end off the round and then this is where we don't see purple for the rest of the game because he actually branches off and goes north while the rest of us make a party and head down south to ambush the last three guys and then if we go down we'll at least have one more squad mate to hopefully clutch the dub but he wasn't the one to clutch it. Another teammate was. I'm not going to tell you which one, but it wasn't me. I'm just saying that. I got knocked, like, right off the bat. But we start to make our way. Our purple guy's falling back. Because he has, like, an epic bolt right now. And then we begin to move up. I look behind just to make sure he's still there. And this is where we spot the first couple guys. And there, there they are. Me and Michael duck behind cover. We get ready to fight, and then we move to the ramps. 
And now, this is where the final fight begins. And then, we don't see them, but I just get a smear glimpse of a guy rifting. There. Yeah, and then he dis disappeared. I don't actually know what happened to him. I might go on the replay and see what happened to that guy, but... Eh, I'll probably post a comment and tell him what happened to that dude. But then, we get fired. I get into the anti-gravity field. Someone was lost in the storm. That's the, the guy that the purple guy took out. And then I get shot in the back. I throw up a couple walls. Because we're in anti-gravity. That doesn't really help much. And then... I see a guy, I jump in, Michael gets knocked, I yeah, fail at a shotgun blast, I get knocked, and then, um, Martic Assass, our purple guy knocks out one, we try to fight back, and, we, and, Cool Island Boy clutches the dub. What a team player right there, guys. So that's how we got our victory royale. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you and I will be seeing you guys tomorrow for the next Fortnite gameplay. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and peace out.